Roy has caught one. Ladies and gentlemen, we're out here fishing. He's got the old dip net. He says it's a good one. Do you need some help, bub? Do you need some help? Roy has caught one, ladies and gentlemen. Do it, Roy. You a good one? Oh, yeah. You mean come up here and help you? Or you got him? That's my son, Roy, right there. Look at him. Look at him go. That boy right there. Oh, shit. I wouldn't take a pretty for him. Oh, you, wow. you have learned well, Grasshopper. We were just fixing to leave, but now we're not. Do it, Roy. Is he pulling the line out? Just play him. Just play him, son. He's a good one, folks. This is a good one. Put a light on the situation. Get him on up there and let's see him. Did he get on? Oh, shit. Get him on up there and put him in the net. Off every time I get we ain't got to see him yet. Watch it be a big gar. <laughs> oh, shit. Well, he's taking off. There he is. Told you we needed a big dip net. There he is. He's a good one. I don't get that. Yeah, but he's a good one. Yeah. Got him, Roy. Oh, Roy has done it. <laughs> We're sitting here fishing, ladies and gentlemen. We got us some jugs out there somewhere floating around. We're jug line fishing. We're, uh, we got a couple of poles a piece out. Chooching on a bowl of gentleman collar from the uh, Cornell and Deal. It's got that deer tongue off into it. Roy, he'd go what? Four or five pounds? That's Maybe good. bigger, five? We thought he was bigger than that. We was just fixing to move to another spot and old Roy nailed it pretty nice. I hate this animal. Yeah, we gotta get a better net. We uh we didn't uh <laughs> hand him back here and I'll help you. Get him get him right behind them. Them things. Don't let him flop out. He's hung on his. Let me pause this and help you. While Troy gets his line untangled, I'm going to show y'all what I'm teaching here. The old gentleman collar. That's got your Virginias, your, your Burleys, and your Perique. And some of that old Dara, I say Dara tongue, off into it. Just look onto it. Oh. And I don't know what the deer tongue is, but I kind of think that is. My fingernails are dirty from fishing out here, but I got my pole set up there. Roy, I'd have passed you a scrimp. Give me a scrimp. A what? There's two or three bags in there. Let me find you one or you got one. We're, we're using scrimp, scrimp. Scrimp, scrimp. I'm going to tell you what. That Dagner is chooching the fire out of this old deer with tongue. This second bow tonight. We was just fixing to move up to where a guy told us earlier to go i've got a green light out there trying to attract some fish up here to the boat some little bait fish we might get dip up or maybe catch this is my little little box i decided to make a i brought a i don't know what this is called the uh country gentleman maybe 
This is my new custom built that I bought. Look under that. I got this custom built off of the eBirds. It's a genuine custom built. If anybody knows this little chin right here on the end, what these style of pipes are, I know if it's got this little thing on top, it's a bull cap on top. But what's that little chin? What's that called? Is that a pot? Bent pot? Would that be what it is? With a bull cap? And then, also brought, I won that on eBay and I paid a pretty penny for it. I didn't get but sixteen fifty for that field, field stub, plus shipping, tax. But I ain't going to tell you what I get for that custom built because I got stupid. This is the... Uh, OG Dublin. This is the original Chuchin weapon from my wind mess pipes. Look what a beautiful pipe. And I got two of them. This one's got just a little cake in it, but I got one with a gold band. And then I got the, the new gen Dublin. Then I got the KT209 Field Master Dublin. Also brought some, some. Uh, I think I'm thinking Clayton Orr give me that gentleman collar right there. I know he gave me this at Latakia Flake, uh, H and H Latakia, 2018, and I know he gave me this here Thanksgiving Day by L J Peretti. But uh, I brought it. Three pipes. I thought Troy might want to chooch, and I brought this. And she can use any of my pipes if you don't mind. I saw a on this pipe. Hey, 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 it's mine. Was that me moving around or was it moving? But anyway, folks, I'm going to pause it again for a little while. Turn off my light. Roy, you want to show them that fish or have you got time? Let me put the light back on. We finally got that fish off and uh, on the scranger. <coughs> he, uh, that was his little bitty pole he was dealing with. Oh, I also wanted to show y'all. Oh, Roy bought us some, some nice Bud Light. Oh, yeah. We're having us a few tasty drinks here while we're doing our fishing and whatnot and so forth and what have you. I know one thing, them shrimp are stinking in there, Roy. That's why I keep that old towel on there. Keep that smell down away from me. But, uh, did you show him? Did we show him? We showed him, didn't we? Huh? Oh, did he? We ain't showed him yet? That's about, uh, at least three or four pounds, ain't it? Pretty nice fish. You cut a couple flays off that rascal and you got something. I'm getting a tight line there. I'm gonna pause it and if I catch something, I'll try to get Troy to get the capture all the excitement and whatnot and what have you. I'll be back. If not a moot, but I'll be back. Oh bird's back. About to chew this big old bow. That's a big bow, you know it. That Dagner. And let me tell you, I've been shooting that deer time. I don't know if you can see my pole out there or not. But, uh, I got nothing over here, and then I got a little bobber right here trying to catch some bait. But, uh, we just caught the one catfish so far. Like I say, I'm still teaching on the Duratong and the Dagna. It's been a great smoke. I really like that the gentleman caller, Clayton Ora, sent off to me. Appreciate that, Clayton. Really enjoying the old Duratong. Roy's up there dipping on snuff, I think. What are you dipping on, Roy? Copenhagen. Copenhagen? Mm, big boy. 
Big money. I dip that red seal. Boy, it is mighty good, and it's a mighty good price. Well, I'm going to pause it one more time, and I'll holler back at you folks here directly. Just in case it goes dead, I'm out.